Hi everyone, uh, welcome back to my channel. This is part one of a haul. So it is mid-June now and um, I ordered quite a bit of stuff during the planner social sale and the made in Canada sale. But then I also ordered a whole bunch of other random stuff because um, I mean, Instagram influenced me and then like through Instagram ads and then um, just seeing, you know, other people's hauls recently. And I just, I just had to. So for this part, I have Cocoa and Fluff, Rose Colored Days, and Niche, cre niche Create, I think is how you say it. I, I'm sorry. Anyway, um, okay, so I'm going to move stuff around and start with, I don't know, one of them. Okay, so we're going to start with Rose Colored Days. And I got these uh, two sets of washi, um, not washi, of foil tapes. So, um, and I already swatched them out here because I know I, I take forever and opening the packaging and just figuring out how to use it and everything. So I got the silver hollow and then I also got just gold. And I was looking at like, I think just like a plain silver and then also a rose gold. And maybe something else. I can't remember. But um, I decided, no, I'm just going to stick with these two to start. Because I had foil tapes before. And they just, they, they would not tear. I pretty much had to pull out my scissors or my cutting tool and cut every single time. Even though they had perforations, they weren't didn't work very well. And it was not rose color days. I honestly don't remember what company it was from. But these were amazing. So I had been watching Brandy Plans and Dawn on Cocoa and Fluff for a while using these kinds of tapes. And um, one of them, I don't remember, mentioned that, like, especially for the big ones, if you, when you pull them off, if you only, you know, un go unroll as much as you need, like for one box and then kind of fold and like, you know, do the perforation, um, like crease it, and then it peels much nicer. Um, so that actually I did find to be true. The only thing was, I think it was this underlay tape. When I was pulling it off, it got like a tear in the next one. But it's underlay. You're not really going to see that. So I'm not really worried about it. Um, the header tape was very, very easy to use. I think because you can just hold and like just like pull and it's just like a smaller, I mean, obviously it's not really as wide, right, as the full boxes. So it just tears a lot easier on that. But I'm very excited to be using these. Um, you'll see them a lot in my um, abstract kits. So yes, that's very exciting. Um, I think next, I don't know. We'll see what I go to next. We'll see what I grab next. Okay, so this one I got from the Made in Canada sale, and I, I'm really excited about this. I've seen her shop for kind of a while now, and I just haven't purchased, um, not because I didn't want to, it's just, I, I don't know. Um, anyway, so this is one of their notebooks, and I'm a sucker for notebooks, and so you do have a choice of... Um, like so the dot grid or lined and whatnot and I think you do have two size option choices um, and then there is a pocket in here which is kind of nice and then I do like that it has this strap thing to hold on oh and it has a nice little ribbon bookmark in there but I thought this design was super cute um, they have another design that I want to get to, but I just wanted to go start with one um, just to see how I liked it. So the paper is, let's read this, it is 96 sheets, um, so 192 pages, um, so that's like front and back. It is 100 GSM paper, um, yeah, and it does feel a little silky, um, like, not, I don't know about silky, but it feels smooth. Um, so I'm going to come back to, yes, I'm going to do the very last page. Um, so I'm going to start with this pen. No, I don't know what this pen is because, um, yeah, but I got it from Aura Estelle. Um, so we're just going to see what this is. 
Okay, so it writes nice and it doesn't smear. Um, okay, so that works. Let's see what happens with a slightly different kind of pen. Mm -hmm. Okay, so here's this. I know this is a gel pen. It's um, a larger tip. It's um, this one probably will smear. Yeah. So I think it's just the kind of pen that it is. Let's look at a mild liner real quick here. Oh, if I can grab one. Okay, I should have planned ahead, but you know. So that's a really light one. I know that that's not gonna ghost or anything like that because it's super light. Let's grab one of the darker ones. Okay, uh, maybe just a little bit, maybe. Um, but honestly, like for something like this, I wouldn't use it. I mean, I might highlight some, excuse my awful handwriting. Yeah, that this pen at least doesn't smear. I'm sure the other one wouldn't if I had let it dry. Um, but honestly, like I got this just because, um, like there are times I just like taking notes for things. Um, I just like having like a random notebook to have for notes. Um, sometimes I'll throw it in my bag to just have scrap paper. Um, and sometimes I just need something to entertain my girls and like we can draw and they can practice um, like writing or scribbling and you know, coloring, whatever. So it's, I just like having notebooks with me. So that's what I got um, that for. And then I also got this cat washi it's so cute i did swatch it out here already i mean look how cute those kitties and cacti are so i i am a dog person in real life but i think cat stuff is it's just so cute um they just draw so cute okay so now there's a bunch of freebies in here which is exciting so there's okay this is like a Oh, that's a magnet. That's kind of cool. It's a dual lingo with a little um, owl with a little stabby, stabby thing. I think this is um, supposed to be a coaster, but I mean, it does feel like, you know, a pressed cardboard kind of thing. Um, so I don't know that it would handle, like hold up to like, if your cup sweats or something like that, but it's cute. Um, and then there's a bunch of random little little stickers it's just adorable okay and then a big big holographic flamingo vinyl okay so this is a um a swap freebie oh okay yeah so swap freebies from made in canada sale okay i get it now i get it i i just for whatever reason i wasn't understanding and i don't i don't know why and then these must be Oh no, this is Alley Cat Shop. Okay, so more swap. I do like this. This is on clear paper. That's pretty script though. That is pretty. Oh, okay, and then the, the flamingo because their, their theme was tropical. That's right, the main Canada sale theme was tropical. Okay, um, and then some more. The hearts are adorable. I like just the scribbled hearts. Those are cute. And then more tropical plants. So many freebies, paper secrets. That's a cute little bunny. Um, planet with stickers. Um, okay, so then these are from this shop here because I recognize the bunny. So adorable. I feel that bunny today, actually. And then, okay, so this is what I ordered. So I got these um, cacti kitties in two sizes because I wasn't sure... I mean, I know that there's a description online about what the sizes are, but I just, I wasn't sure and I wanted to see in person. So here's the kitties in the two sizes. Um, and I do plan on putting this in my new Oro Estelle in the daily, which is why I got the washi to go with it to decorate together. And then I got this, there's just mad plant wall magical. I just think they're so cute. And the little angry mandrakes and all sorts of fun stuff. So, um, I'll probably go back for more of this because these are simply adorable. 
But yeah, so that is my order. Tons of freebies, super exciting. And I can't wait to start getting this deco in my planner. Okay, so last for this part um, is Cocoa and Fluff. And if you've been around my channel for a while, you know that I absolutely love and adore Cocoa and Fluff because, well, I mean, I used to PR for her and I opened my own shop and now I don't PR for her anymore. But I, I love Dawn and I love everything she does and she's amazing. And so I'm going to use her stuff and shout all the amazing things that she does every chance I get. So I got a few things here. So the I got this um, clean colored dot. Um, she has these in her journaling bundles and I just didn't get the journaling bundle that has the purple in it. Um, I think it's technically violet. Um, I'm going to call it purple. So anyway, <laughs> yeah, it's super pretty. I like it. Excuse my handwriting. Anyway, so it does have that dual tip. It has the dot. It has the what you can write with. Um, I love, love, love these for my list making. I already have two, like a coral and a um, gray color. I use them all the time. So absolutely had to have this. Love it to pieces. And then I got some washi. You can't really see it on the roll there, but I swatched it out for you. So it's this one here with the little alien scuba diving. It matches one of her alien um, island life kits. So I had to get I had to get the washi. Um, and then I also picked up one of her um, wax melts. So she does well wax melt boxes, and while. Um, I love them. It's just, you know, being on a budget, I can't, I can't get every single thing that I want. Um, but I, she listed some of these separately. And so I was like, you know what? I do really want to try some of them. So I picked up one. This is the Limoncello Cream. And oh, it's so cute. I love, I love all of the little deco on there. Oh, and yes, it smells like a sweet Limoncello. So like some lemon shows can be pretty sour, not in a bad way, but just, you know, it's alcohol, right? And lemon alcohol. But this is a very sweet smell to it, like sugary lemon cello. Oh, I love it. I cannot wait to melt this. And actually my mom comes in tonight. And so I think I'm going to put a wax burner in her room and let her burn some of this if she so desires. Um, Anyway, like, because I have a dog and children and the house just it has smells, right? Houses just have smells. So I love, um, love that. I can't wait to it. I, I, I can't wait to use it. And I think I have to go and get more. Oh, well, she took them off the site because it's, um, summer and she doesn't want them to melt. Dawn, I am getting more of this whenever you put stuff back up on the site. Just a heads up. Okay. I'm going to stop talking while I open this because it's going to crinkle. So, okay. And I had to tell myself that I was going to stop talking while it's crinkling because if I didn't, I wasn't going to, and I'm sorry. So, um, these are the shop swaps. So <laughs> there's my shop. And then here's, this is Willow Way or Wilson Wild. Excuse me. I saw the two W's. Um, I was just making stuff up. So Crafty Pal Creations. Ooh, I like that paper. That's neat. I like that paper. Okay, and then this is Stickies by CNS. Oh, okay, they're like little washi strips. That's cute. Um, Irish Acres Designs, the cute red, white, and blue puppy dog. And then um, Eliza Ra Ravel. I can't read that. I'm, I have terrible eyesight. I can't read, but the hydrate with the little glasses is, is nice. I like that because I, I mean, always trying to track my, my hydration. Okay. So I got a few of the new, um, um, leafy, I was going to call it sprout and I don't know why. I got a few of the new leafy, um, things. So this is like the mood tracker. It's 1.5 inch wide. And I think I'm going to be putting this in my, um, daily, um, health and wellness planner that I have from the penny pages. And I can just like mark off which one I'm feeling in the day. Cause you know, you know, you, you have more than one mood in a day, right? Okay. And then leafy stressed out and then leafy recharge. Can you, can you notice a pattern in my life at the moment? Yes. That's, yes, that's just where we're at. Okay, and then, oh, okay, hold on. This is just my, um, yay, 
This is just my packing slip. Okay, and she always writes me sweet notes and I appreciate her so much. Okay, so then we've got, I'm gonna do, I think the freebies here next because I just, I can't, I can't help myself. It's so cute. So there's this all orders freebie. And then this is the planner social sale freebie. So this one was just available during the planner social sale. The rest of this is available um, all month long. You can tear up. So this is the Be Happy Quotes, which is so cute. And this is on like a frosted clear paper. Oh, and those little bees are cut out. Sweet. Okay, and then this is the Be Happy Kit. So this is, um, you tear all the way up to this. Do, do, do. Okay, let me do this one first. Okay, so... These are washi and like a journaling page. Um, so this comes next and then you go all the way up to um, a kit. So Dawn knows me and um, she knows I love her Hobonichi kits. So she sent me this Hobonichi cousin kit. It's be happy. It is ink and adorable. I love all the bees and that washi. I mean, come on. So, so cute. And I think I might have to put this in my planner for next week. I don't know. We'll see. And then this is the monthly. So Hobo Cousin monthly. Oh, look at the little bees. So cute. Um, oh, maybe I can use this. So I already have um I already have July and August laid down for my monthly. Maybe I'll use this for September. I mean, I know it's bees and it's September, but I mean it's cute. I mean, why wouldn't I? It's it's cute. Why wouldn't I want to use it? Okay, anyway, there's that. I'm going to set these off to the side. I'm going to juggle some stuff around because I know I know I got a lot of stuff and I know that I'm going to be wanting to show you all the things. Okay, so this is Island Life and this is a completely hand-drawn kit from her, which I think is amazing like it is not easy I mean she even does all the backgrounds and stuff like for my hand-drawn kits I don't do the backgrounds um I also you know have two little ones so <laughs> that I'm constantly trying to chase what I'm drawing so there's that but um I mean how cute is this like they're underwater they're so adorable and they're snorkeling that's why I got that's why I got the washi because I mean, it's just so cute okay Dawn I'm gonna stop I love them. I love it all. And the squiggly stuff. And I just, I love the shapes of her boxes. Just how it's so different. And it's just so unique. It's so dawn. Everything is so bright and so colorful and so many fun boxes. This is 100% dawn. And I absolutely love it. And I know um, she's going to be making more. Um, no, not more of the alien kits. Maybe more alien kits. I'm thinking about something else. I, I'm thinking about the leafy kits. She's making a lot more leafy kits, which I'm super stoked about. Um, but yeah, those are all her style too, like just 100% her. So I'm super excited for all the hand-drawn stuff that she's doing. Um, okay, next up is this Perk Up collection. And so Dawn and I um, decided to do kind of like a collab so we um, got the same artwork and made kits out of it, right? And so for June, we did this coffee um, coffee artwork, which is so cute. I love, I love coffee. I love the bakery feel of it. It's, it's so fun. Um, it's very watercolory. It's artwork I picked. Um, <laughs> if you can't tell, and I love watercolor, but Dawn... Dawn was on board for it. She really enjoyed it too. And um, thinking about doing, you know, another one um, for another month for you guys like this. So this, I just, I really love how she used everything. I love these boxes of hers too, where she puts the um, patterns behind the boxes there. Um, and so, yeah. I really love how she used everything and I can't wait. Um, so, you know, you can pick up my kit format in my shop, but then go over to her shop and check her stuff out because it's just, it's so amazing. And I mean, because it's the same stuff, you can definitely mix and match everything. So, okay, that is, I think I'm at the end of this part. 
like I'm telling you, I have so much stuff. Oh, no, I'm not technically. So this sweatshirt that I have, I know you can't like see, I know it's just like tan sleeves, right? So I purchased this sweatshirt. Um, it's a get your pink back sweatshirt. I'm going to include a picture of it so you can see um, because there's no, there's no brand on camera. Um, but I absolutely love it. And I love the message that it sends, like give it, get your pink back because flamingos lose their pink color um, when they have little kids, little babies, um, because all of their energy and nutrients are going to their children. Um, but eventually, once their children get older, they start to get their pink back because they can, you know, start taking care of themselves again. And so I just think it's so true and just a good reminder for myself right now in this time of life. Anyway, I'll include a picture of it so you guys can see. Um, and yeah, I will be back, well, in just a second for you, um, but I will be back when I have more to share. Okay, so for this next part of the haul, I have three shops. I have um, the Penny Pages, Tipsy Dog Designs, and more Cocoa and Fluff because I have zero restraint when it comes to Cocoa and Fluff. Um, so I'm just going to start, you know, left to right here. Um, so this was from the Made in Canada um, sale with the Penny Pages. And so these were two of the freebies. And then this is an adorable freebie of uh, Millie the cow. So Destiny over the penny pages, her daughter Hazel um, is starting to draw and, and put um, her own character and her own kits into the shop. And it's this Millie the cow. And I think she's just so stinking adorable. I just, I had to pick up a few things from her. So there's this with Millie with the little flamingo floaty. And I think it's just perfect for like my girls playing outside right now because we have a water table, we have a splash pad and all the other stuff. So I just thought that was super cute and I had to get that. And then this is the campfire kit. Oops, sorry, I'll scoot down. Campfire kit with Millie, which I think is just so adorable. So that's the full boxes. This is um, one of the journaling pages, which I did get that add on. Okay, so a whole bunch of functionals and then washi and date covers and all kinds of headers. I love the s'mores on that. Oh, this is the other part of the journaling kit. So it goes there. And then here's check boxes, more um, headers and headers and, you know, functional tracker things. And then all kinds of fun scripts and some doodle squiggles and whatnot, which are always fun to do. Okay, more boxes. So these are square boxes and then half and third, like quarter or whatever. Um, I saw or whatever because I, I'm not sure. Um, quarter or third boxes, but yeah. And then um, cloud boxes. These are so fun to layer with stuff. Okay, so that's the campfire kit. And then this is the O Canada, o Canada journaling kit, which I just I love the colors. I thought it was so fun. I just, I had to. Um, so this is everything from the penny pages and I will be right back with the next shop. Next up is Tipsy Dog Designs and this is her snarky subscription. This is the first, um, first month I've gotten it. I don't want to ruin the pups. I have not opened it yet. As you can see, I did cheat and watch the, um, the video when her YouTube video when it first um, came out of this month, or I guess at the start of June when she first, um, when these first became available. <laughs> She's been doing this a few months. Like, why am I saying when she first, when this one came available? And um, I remember um, seeing it, but I don't remember what they say. And I'm not going to read these out loud because of, you know, any little ears that might be around. So... There's this one, and this is a vinyl, um, vinyl sticker here. Um, yeah, and then these are such a pretty, pretty foil. Let's see if I can get that. And I think this is one of everything that's in the sheet, or in the in the um, subscription this month. So there's that, and then here we go. Okay, 
That one I could read, but you know. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay. <laughs> yep, okay. This is, yep, 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 sweatpants all the time. <laughs> yep, yep, again. Okay, so there is that subscription, and I, I can't wait to start using all these goodies. Um, yeah. Oh, okay, so I'm cleaning these up, but I just noticed that I, I skipped a page because they stuck together. Yep, there we go. Okay, so this is very exciting. I'm excited for that. Okay, and then last for this part of the haul is Cocoa and Fluff. Um, so yes, I did have to make a second order. Um, these are the freebies. So this is an all order freebie. These are the PR freebies. So this one is Brandy's. There's Tara's. And then Sabrina. And then this is another freebie. And then, so she's doing tiered freebies for the whole month. There's this one. This is on a, a clear paper as well, so you can layer it with some things. And then these two pages, which I'm excited about this um, to use in my, um, my journal. Okay. And then getting into my order. So these are from the, I think it's called Island Life. Um, her aliens, um, one of her new aliens kits. And I didn't get the sticker pack before when I got all the, he's so cute, when I got all the aliens because I don't know, I, I don't know. I must have just overlooked it. But it's just so, I mean, they're so stinking adorable, everything in here, right? It's just, it's all so cute. Um, little beach ball, some flowers and some leaves, and a drink. Oh, they're so cute. Everything, more leaves, another drink, oh, another little fishy. So I'm excited to put these um, on my planners, put them in my journaling spreads, all, everything. And this feels kind of like, this feels like vinyl. So I feel like, um, I don't know if it's waterproof or not, but it feels like vinyl. So I'd be interested to try, test one out and just see. Um, but those are so stinking adorable. And um, I got the, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay, okay, we're good. I did not even realize I put that down like that. Um, anyway, I'd be excited to see if they are waterproof, because if they are, I might put them on a few things. Okay, and then she just released a whole bunch of Leafy, a new character, and I am obsessed. So here's the Hogwarts houses. There's Leafy reading. Ah! I can't do anything right today, apparently. Um, there's YouTube Leafy and laundry leafy and coffee leafy and then hot because it's hot down here in the south so all those adorable leafies and then i also got some kits with the new leafy so this is cafe leafy this is the hobo cousin kit so it's a two-page kit and i love 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 this washi down here it's so cute um so pretty I like how it looks kind of like a chalkboard too. So there's that. And then this is the um, uh, the Hobo Cousin um, Monthly. And so I haven't tried her Hobo Cousin Monthlies yet. So I'm really excited for this to see how this goes. So there's that that I got. And then I also got the standard um, eight page kit. So there's all the full boxes and she did all of this art herself. It's all so stinking adorable. Coffee is a hug in a mug. It's so true. And then again, the adorable washi. 
And then you've got functionals. And I like how she did these as like blackout since her date covers are black. That's smart. I like that. And then let's see. We have functionals and more functionals. I love these boxes and how she does her paint swatches with the art in it and everything. And then more functionals and headers. And this is one of my favorite pages. So I like how she has all of the, um, the scripts and some of her leafy characters in here. But I really like these. These are really good for headers, like putting your own script in. If like, you know, one of these doesn't have what you need or something. I like doing headers in here. And then my check boxes. So what I'll usually do is I'll color coordinate these and just, yeah. Anyway, and this is just so cute. I love the colors. I love these so much. Okay, so that was this part of the haul and I'll be right next with the next part. Okay, so we are back for the final part of this haul. And so I have Hubman and Chub Girl, uh, Tilly Bee Plans, and Tiny Little Tulip. And I'm super excited. Uh, so I'm gonna move some stuff around here. See, so first up, I'm going to do Hubman and Chub Girl. So this was during their um, vault release sale. So I did get two pins. So I got the owl, the Hedwig, and the Baby Yoda one. I know his name's is Group. Uh, he's Baby Yoda to me. Anyway, so I got these. I am not, I never collected pins. I see people collecting them. I mean, just never have. However, when I get the Hubman and Chub Girl um, big boxes, they come with pins and they're so cute. And so I actually ordered a pin board from Amazon. So I'm going to start putting these up on my wall next to my desk. I, I don't know. I don't know why I feel the need to do it now, but they're just super cute. So I'm going to do that. Um, okay. And then this is, I think I just got the one kit actually. Oh yeah. So I got this um, Hufflepuff die cut sticker. I put one on my um, previous planner cover and I'm changing out planners and so I wanted another one to hold on to. And then this is the Wizards Hobonichi Cousin kit and it's just super cute. I almost bought like five of them just to have them but I mean I'm really trying hard not to hoard a bunch of stuff. So yeah I just got the one. I think this is the smallest order I've ever gotten from Hubman and Chub Girl. But it's still very exciting. Okay, next up is Tiny Little Tulip. And so I ordered this during um, her latest sale. I honestly can't remember what which sale it was. Um, anyway, and so this was a June freebie. Just super cute with the little monsters on it. And then I got this foil. And then this is a matte silver. So it's not supposed to be super sparkly. Um, but it's the Spoonie kit. And um, so it has some quotes here. Um, so it's a Spoonie, someone living with a chronic illness. My illness does not define me. Um, more headers and overlay boxes with spoons. Um, and then the underlays of spoons, more underlays. And then the washi and... Um, icons and then scripts and these are so I love these um why did I waste a spoon on this and all my spoons are in the dishwasher so so accurate so this is my first um foil bundle from tiny little tulip I've been eyeing this one for a while so I'm super excited to um have it now and I just I feel like I'm gonna hoard it because I don't know what kit to use it with but I love it so here we go and then this is um, a journaling kit from her. So I'm trying to branch out and try different journaling kits um, to go in my new planner for my daily. And I will show a setup video of that later. But yes, um, I really kind of like how this looks. Um, I have a couple journaling kits from other shops um, that I'm going to try as well and see how I want to set up that space and what I like. So I will probably get more tiny little tulips because this is, this is nice. I like this. Okay. On to the last part. 
Okay, so this last one is from Tiny Little Tulip. And so I got this during the last planner social sale, uh, which is very exciting. So we have some freebies here. I'll go through those first. So there's some swap freebies from some of the shops. Okay, and then these were her tiered freebies. I'm getting real sick of pants and responsibilities. That is true. Very, very true. Okay, so these are just really fun. Um, can use these on wherever. I'm not wearing glasses anymore. I've seen enough. <gasps> oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, so those are the tiered freebies that I got. And then here are the sheets that I ordered. So this is to lead tired sleeping. That's me every morning when my daughter comes to wake me up. And then this is like overwhelmed, stressed one, because it has, I don't know if, I don't know if I can get close enough for you to see here. But it's got dinner, dishes, uh, to-do list, shower, workout, uh, scrub the toilet, work, put on pants, all the things that I dread every day. And then Tilly with her mug and the blanket. It's super cute. Okay, and then I, if you can tell, I really liked, I really liked a, <laughs> a kit here. So I got the Toasty in the Hobonichi Cousin format. So this is the bonus sheet. And then this is the kit. So it's a two-page kit. And I haven't gotten her Hobonichi Cousin kits before, but this is just super cute and I wanted to try it out. So we went with this one. And then I also got it in the standard vertical format. So I got the bonus sheet because I like these boxes and these are fun too. Um, it's neat seeing what she's added and changed in the kit since the last time I got one. But um, I do really like all of these paint swatch boxes. And then there's the full boxes. And so we have a bunch of functionals here. Um, more boxes. Washi and some header boxes. Some date covers and icons and such. And then some more headers, a whole bunch of script, which is nice. Some more icons and meals. And yeah, so this is very exciting. I'm really excited to get started with um, or to try out the new format of her kit because I haven't gotten one in a while. I've been trying to be really good about not over buying my stickers anymore, but <laughs> That worked out well this month, huh? Anyway, thank you guys so much for um, hanging out. Um, please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.